Hey, hello, my fellow YouTuber. It is Monday, February 12th, 5.03 a.m. Denver time. Let's go and see what's going on on ShitTube. First, a little notice. Now, our Dr. Paul has a Patreon link. Uh, Got to hurry up and get some more of that money. And maybe he learned something, but when he did uh, his first live broadcast, he couldn't even figure out how to slow down chat. But he got some assistance to do up a Patreon link. 50,000 people cremated. The source for this 50,000 is an exiled businessman. I mean, I got out, Gu Wing Hang, or whatever the hell. Uh, China has charged him with rape, bribery, kidnapping, money laundering, and fraud, and the U.S. of A. is harboring him. I know, they're going to say China made up the charges because they're mad at him. They want to bring him back to the U.S. Or they, that, well, the chief ran off after he got the charges. Who knows what the hell. This dude's exiled. He's in the U.S., but I know he's got secret sources that tell him what's going on. Anyway, he says that there's 49 crematoriums there, and they are going 24-7, 24-7, and have been for 17 days. Okay, I uh, googled how long does it take to cremate a body? Anywhere from 1 to 7 hours. Let's say it's 1 hour. Four times 49 uh, crematoriums times 24 hours is 1,176 bodies. Hopefully I did my math right. So it would take, I don't know, 40, 40 plus days to cremate 50,000 people. Okay, uh, everybody's running around now. These truthers of ours are running around with this windy.com thing showing the heat signature from the sulfur dioxide. Uh, if you go read the comments, there's people there with a little bit of common sense. Uh, they say it could be burning the medical waste, you know, all their clothing. could be a combination of burning the medical waste and all the pets they're killing, the, all those cats and dogs. Makes sense, right? If that's where it's even coming from, any sort of people bodies or pet bodies. <clears throat> but no, they can't talk about that. And when the person commented that it could be uh, medical waste or pets, uh, whoever is running this channel says... Uh, well, no, they wouldn't burn the pets now because they used to they used to just bury them. Yeah, but if they're massacring pets, you're going to have to burn them because they don't, especially because these retards seem to think they're carrying the virus. I suppose they could if you sneeze or cough on them or whatever, you know, but they carry them in their blood system. Not a damn shred of evidence whatsoever. <coughs> uh, AMTV, he says uh, China is executing the sick who claim they're not sick and then are proven sick, so China's executing them. Right, where the fuck did you get that? Uh, uh, he's also relating the coronavirus to the bubonic plague. Lisa Haven is relating the coronavirus to uh, the 1813 or whatever it was, Spanish flu. These people are, <laughs> these people are off the charts. But anyway, if you want to go help and save China and save the USA, you can go to Dr. Paul Control and now donate to his Patreon. Uh, Her Majesty Five left a great comment. How is money going to help these truthers avoid censorship? You know, send me money, send me money. It's, oh my God, YouTube is censoring me. Yeah, censoring you to write to bigger cash. Uh, Marf Stern and the others are all proud to report that this coronavirus has now killed more than sows. SARS. Whoopie doopie ding dong. Uh, 2,000, you know, all these numbers are different depending on what site you go to. 774 were killed by SARS. Uh, and there's supposed to be over 800 now dead of uh, the coronavirus. And let's not forget that the world population is 7.7 7 billion people. Billion with a B. <coughs> uh, oh, you want to talk about what's sad. There's now, they're now saying there's 70 people with the coronavirus aboard that cruise ship. How would you like to be stuck in a freaking sardine can like that where everything is recycled and you cannot do a damn thing about it to get away from that crap? I mean, they show them interviewing uh, some of the Americans. On, I think they did two sets of Americans, you know, one of them, her husband's sick, I think. And, and what can you do? You know, they're not going to let you go nowhere. Even if you sneak out and jump off the ship, where the hell are you going to go? <laughs> I mean, it's, I would not want to be stuck in something, you know. Then people stuck aboard that ship, literally like sardines in a can, is no different than, 11, than those 11 million people crammed into that city of Wuhan, which uh, it was 3,200 something square miles. It's pathetic what they are doing to their own people. But no, oh, BP Earth Watch, AMTV, and I know other people are doing it, and even the website, I forget the big one that's showing this uh, sulfur dioxide map, and uh, BP. It says, I'm going to zoom out here. And AMTV only, if they zoom out enough, or if you go check that out, off to the left of Wuhan, there's another city there with the same 
heat signature. It's smaller, but it's the same colors. It's putting off the same, oh, excuse me, it's putting off the same sulfur dioxide. I went to windy.com, and I don't know if it's because I'm just freaking uh, ignorant, which I'm trying to figure out how to use my phone. I could not figure out how to get, I clicked on the sulfur dioxide thing, but I don't know if I just couldn't read it right and tried to look at all over the, you know, all over the whole damn planet. But, uh, you know, to say that uh, uh, they're burning, uh, God dang it, there was another one. Oh, matter of fact, on that, there was another comment on that site saying uh, somebody or two different people guesstimated they would have to burn 14,000 bodies uh, to get that much sulfur dioxide. And it's the same thing every freaking time with these truthers. Every time some other thing pops up, they're going to pick the highest possible number they, they can figure out that anybody's putting out, no matter how unreliable this like zero hedge and all these others that came around and they're freaking idiots everybody's when they put out an article everybody takes it and all these truthers take it and run with it but <laughs> yeah especially lisa conspir comparing this to the uh the spanish flu and that box mining channel you know uh i never even heard of that dude until bought dr paul cattrell brought him up he's a crypto thing like amtv he doesn't do the uh over obvious fear porn bullshit like AMTV does, but he's still using the coronavirus to advance his crypto sales. I mean, all, the, all these people are sitting up there. What a joke. I mean, they're, they're, is there any truth in the community? Uh, these people talking about, oh my God, they know what's coming. Some of these U.S. hospitals are prepping. Well, isn't that what they're supposed to do? And yes, it's coming here. Yes, because it is here. Is it going to spread like over there? No, it's not. Capital N O. Oh, my last video, go read. Uh, my buddy Buford left me a pretty good comment. Oh, it's all in capital letters, too. He needs anger, anger management counseling. But the prep, okay. The hospitals don't prepare. The coronavirus starts to spread here. And what's going to happen? Like with anything else, the truthers would put out videos. Oh, why didn't they get ready? They knew it was coming. Why? When I said you can't win or lose with these truthers, you can't win. You can lose all the time. You can't win with these freaking idiots. Um, and again, the box mining channel, what a joke. That dude's putting out stupid reports. He doesn't know a damn thing. Sure, he's over there in China somewhere, but that, that doesn't mean he knows jack shit. And all this frickin' that, st that stupid businessman source has been exiled from China. Uh, 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 <coughs> anyway, that's it for now, and I'll see you later. Bye.